Hey everyone, it's Mark and I'm back at Aluma Trailers and right now we're going to go through the spare tire mount, a side mount for our 77 and our 78 series trailer. Today we're going to install one on a 7816 tandem, but I wanted to show you what you're going to get in the kit and how the tools you'll need to install it. So obviously when you get the kit in, you're going to get our back plate mount, which will go inside the rail of our slotted rail. It's going to have our part number in there, our slots for our U-bolt. Uh, and we'll show you how the profile goes when we go to install it. Along with that, you're gonna get the actual U-bolt, our two spacers, and our two chrome lug nuts. The tools you're gonna need to install this mount are your impact and your three quarter inch socket. So with that, let's move over to the trailer and let's make it happen. Okay, for this install, being this is a 16 foot trailer, tandem axle trailer, you have multiple positions. You can mount this spare tire mount on the side couple things we recommend. We usually recommend mounting spare tires on the passenger side. Obviously that is, you know, the curbside safety reasons is the main uh, point that we always tell people mount it on the curbside. If you get a flat tire and you're on the highway, you really don't want to be in traffic getting your spare tire out. So with that, this mount, as we said, there's multiple pieces. The one thing that we like to point out on this is if you look at the angle of this, there is a curve to this. This piece is gonna go inside the inside channel here. So the U-bolt will go through and that curvature will go inside the trailer. Now for our mount here, we're gonna mount in this slot. So we'll slide this spare tire mount through there. And just so you know, this is a one person job, but sometimes second person, second set of hands is nice, but it can be done by one person. So then you'll mount your spare tire on the trailer. and we'll use our spacers. Now these spacers will go inside the rim to kind of stabilize it. Then your cone nuts will go on there. Then we'll grab our impact and your three quarter inch socket and we'll tighten it up. Now make sure they seat in there so you get a good seat, otherwise it could damage the rim. And that's the installation of the side mount on a 78 and a 77 series trailer.